And you know who else wants to be recognized and who wants to be valued? Our furry friends. Our furry friends, our pets, that's right, because they are valued members of our family. But traveling with them, though, sometimes can be difficult because many hotels aren't so accommodating. What's up with that? You know what? What's People up don't with understand. That? They're our family. We don't Absolutely. leave them without them. That's right. But Jada Montemorano is oh. at the Fairmont at Century Plaza where they are accommodating. Good morning to you. Dog's belt backwards says it all. Good morning. <laughs> I know who wouldn't want to bring their furry family members to beautiful sunny Southern California and maybe go for a catch with Laurel, the new director of pet relations here. She's so much fun and active and that's what the hotel really wants for you and your cats and dogs to come here, experience the city together and you can bring them for free. Hey. This is Laurel walking the halls and checking the rooms to make sure everything is dog approved for opening day at the new Fairmont Century Plaza Hotel. She is the director of pet relations at this property and takes her role very seriously. Nine. Laurel was a little shy, so her dog dad Juan Leonis tells us her main mission is to make people happy. So uh, that's her number one joy in life. Juan is also the director of rooms for the hotel and has bounced around the country working at different Fairmont properties, which made it hard to have a dog of his own. So that's why he jumped at the opportunity to blend work and pleasure by volunteering to be Laurel's guardian. There you go. She goes home and comes to work with Juan every day. They're now best friends. Laurel, heel. Laurel actually trained for years with the Guide Dog Foundation in hopes of being a full-time service animal, but it wasn't the perfect fit. A couple of months ago, Laurel decided for a career change uh, and she decided to get into hospitality. But this means Laurel is qualified for the director position, where the job requirements are following commands, being well-behaved, interacting with anyone of all ages, boosting morale amongst employees, welcoming guests, and of course, having fun. <laughs> Other Fairmont hotels in the country have their own director of pet relations. The company hopes to show their forward thinking with pets. Not only can your furry friends stay in your hotel room, you can take them on walks along routes the hotel provides, and even have Laurel tag along. We look at pets as uh, an extension of family and, and not as a pet. And LA is a city of dog lovers. There are more than 2.6 million privately owned cats and dogs in LA County. Uh, good girl. With the International Pet and Animal Transportation Association oh, saying over 2 million pets are transported <laughs> by air every year in the U.S. An increase Juan has noticed. A lot of uptick, whether it's pets, it's cats, for example. People don't leave to leave home without their pets nowadays. Uh, and they want them to be there to experience the vacation as they would. This is why Laurel's first official dog cree was to make cats and dogs free at the hotel, even though Juan has a seen some other here. interesting guests. Not here, but in uh, San Francisco, we had a mini horse. <laughs> Maybe don't bring a mini horse, Sit. but your furry family members are Sit. always welcome. <gasps> Ready, go get it. <laughs> Just coming and interacting with a dog, maybe if you're traveling alone, would be such a fun time, right? It really brings up your spirits and brings you that joy. So if you're traveling alone, you can come hang out with Laurel and even take her on a walk. And do they have dog walkers and pet sitters and all that kind of stuff, dog menus? Dog menus definitely will be coming. There'll be an in-service menu in the hotel, and it's all going to be Laurel approved. <laughs> so now I have to ask you a bit of a taboo question. All right, Jada, what if you are somebody, right, because there could be people out there this morning that are watching that are going, hey, that bah, looks cool, humbug. but I'm not into pets, or maybe I have an allergy. <laughs> How are they protected at the hotel? Yes, very true. If you have an allergy, they do have rooms where dogs or cats never will enter, so you can request those as well. Of course, they want to be accommodating to everyone. All right, Jada, thank you so much. Glorious. All are welcome. I'm telling you, <laughs> if you're a dog lover, a cat lover, ferrets, rabbits, guinea pigs, hamsters, they're all welcome. <laughs>